Hello everyone, my name is Arohi and welcome to my channel. So guys, in this video, I'll show you how you can use DeepStream on Jetson Nano. So DeepStream is developed by NVIDIA and it provides a powerful platform for building real-time AI-powered applications. So it is designed to process and analyze large streams of data in real time with low latency, making it ideal for applications such as uh, video surveillance, smart cities and autonomous vehicles. So basically this DeepStream is a SDK that includes libraries, APIs and pre-trained models for building and deploying AI powered applications okay but uh, developers can also use this SDK to create custom pipelines for data processing and you know analysis so let's start with the um, installation part let me show you practically how you can uh, use DeepStream on Jetson Nano before installing DeepStream let's check the CUDA and TensorRT version so CUDA and TensorRT are included in the Jetpack SDK as a part of the software package. Okay, so that means there is no need to install them manually. So when you install the Jetpack SDK on your Jetson Nano, so these CUDA and TensorRT are by default, uh, you'll get it in the, your software package. Okay, so this makes it convenient for developers to start building and deploying AI applications on Jetson Nano without needing, you know, to separately install these components so let's check the version so to check the versions you will do just open the terminal first so we are opening the terminal and here you will write nvcc space hyphen hyphen version here you can check the CUDA version right so we are using CUDA 10.2 now let's check the TensorRT version so by writing this command you can check the TensorRT version and here you can see the tensor rt version i'm using is this okay so both the things are installed now guys uh, now what i want is if you have already tried to install the deep stream but uh, you were not successful then i recommend you to uninstall everything related to deep stream first and that you can do with the help of these three commands okay so these three commands you only need to run if you have already installed deep stream but you were not successful first so that we can delete every file which is related to deep stream and then we will install the deep stream step by step before installing DeepStream, we need to install the dependencies, dependencies which are required when we want to install DeepStream. So for that, you will run this command. This is the command. You will write this command in terminal. I have mentioned all these commands in the description section. You can copy the commands from there one by one and you can execute. Next step is to install the DeepStream SDK and for that you will write this command sudo apt-get install DeepStream 6.0 and hit enter. You will have DeepStream 6 installed and once you have done that, let's verify the DeepStream installation if it is successful or not. So for that we will run this command this and hit enter and you can see DeepStream app version and DeepStream SDK. Let's test the DeepStream. So for testing the DeepStream there are some sample applications. We can uh, test the DeepStream on those sample applications and by default the path of those sample applications are this OPT NVIDIA DeepStream samples hit enter and here here you will see that we are getting this error no such file or directory so by default the path is this where you can find the sample um, you know applications but in my case we are not getting the sample at the default location so now we have to find out the location where the sample applications are so for that we will run this command so by running this command we will locate the deep stream related files so after running this command we can see that our sample apps are present at this location now we will cd to this location to run this application so this is the command cd and this is the location where our sample apps are and hit enter so now if you want to see it over here also just click on other location and then computer 
and here click on opt and then nvidia after that deepstream deepstream 6.0 and in this you will find the sources and then apps and here you can find the sample app so these are the different sample apps you can try and today we are going to try this application deepstream hyphen test one let's open it and inside it you will see these many different files okay so now let's run this application deepstream test one okay so for that we first need to enter in this directory so that's what we are doing now we will run this command see this and then here we are providing the path of the video on which we want to perform the testing and the path is opt nvidia deepstream deepstream 6.0 samples and then streams let's see where these streams are come out of this deepstream 6.0 and in this we have the samples and then here we have streams here you will find the different videos and images or audio okay you can perform testing on uh, you know any of these videos or images so the video which i chose is this and you can find it here okay so now let's run it this kind of output you will get when you will hit enter and uh, you will see a video stream with detections and this is how you can run deep stream on Jetson Nano. So guys this is just a first lecture on deep stream so in my upcoming videos we will cover more about deep stream and how to work with the custom pipelines and some other things okay. So I hope this video is helpful uh, if you like my content please like share and subscribe my channel thank you for watching.